Hey guys, today we're back with another gum review. And today on the channel, we have the Sig Sauer P210. Stay tuned for this one. <laughs> All right, guys, we're back. Once again, today we'll be doing the unboxing review for the Sig Sauer P210. Uh, this gun was made uh, March 26th of 2018, so it is a brand new gun. And the top of it uh, has just padding. This is a normal 6 hour black box. You'd think it'd come with a little bit something uh, different than the normal ones, but I'm still fine with it. Uh, it comes with a lock up here on top, just a safety flare, a 6 hour, I guess, booklet. And uh, some interesting I've never seen in another six hour booklet besides this one right here is a warning saying uh, be careful pretty much the the trigger is very light and it'll go off on uh, with any bit of uh, I guess you could say pressure on it so uh, you can pause the video and read that if you'd like to I thought that was really interesting never seen that before and it also comes with a tool to sight in the gun never seen that either so we will set this to the side and get to the main event here is the Sig Sauer P210. This uh, is supposed to be, and I would also agree with it, the best 9mm ever built for target, if uh, not ever built in general. This gun has, has a 5 inch carbon steel barrel, a stainless steel slide, a stainless steel frame with nitron coating on all of it, target walnut grips, as you can see it's beautiful, and two 8 round magazines. It's about the only thing I could uh, think about it that wasn't uh, pleasant was the capacity, but like it anyway. Front is a high vis red green with a checkered back sight, as you can see. Really, really, really beautiful gun. You can rack this thing back and it feels like it's on ball burns. Seriously. Uh, you all know I've had a Wilson Combats, um, every single Sig saw ever built, every single Glock ever built. Uh, Berettas, everything, and I've never felt a, sm a smoother slide than this one right here. If y'all can hear this, it's just crazy. Uh, really, really nice back target sights for elevation and windage. I like that pretty well. It even has it uh, marked for which way to go. This has a 3.3 pound or 3.5 pound trigger, so you breathe on the thing and it goes off. Uh, the lightest trigger I've ever felt, even uh, beat the Wilson Combat uh, CQB I had, if that means anything to you. This gun right here retails about around $1,500, MSRP on six websites, 17 so you're going to be able to find them anywhere from 17 to 15 or even lower. My local gun store had this in for $1,449, Bud's Gun Shop. I actually got this in at a gun show this weekend. Uh, this gun right here is pretty much a unicorn. You really uh, rarely ever see them, and when you do see them, uh, you better grab a hold of one if you're wanting it because it's not going to be there long, let me tell you. Has a really interesting safety on it, just like a 1911. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so you just flip it down, safety off, fire, flip it up, safety on, will not fire. Uh, but they say not to load one into the chamber until you're ready to use it. That's uh, your own uh, choice on whatever you want to do with that, but I'd uh, about agree with them because let me tell you something. You throw one into this and you breathe on it. You got a little bit of take up right there and the wall is 3.5 pounds. It don't even feel like, I mean, I swear you can barely even feel yourself hit it. Um, love the magazine well on the bottom of it. These are full walnut grips with a palm swell as you can see and it fits your hand just like a glove. Fits my hand just like a glove. Front uh, serrations on the grip, I like that also very well. And uh, let me just tell you something, this gun right here, if you get one, uh, this right here will probably be a channel uh, channel keeper. So be looking forward to more videos of this one. It is really my favorite 9 millimeter I've ever had. Only thing that would uh, make me want to sell this gun is if they come out with a uh, P210 in uh, just straight up uh, non-nitron coated stainless steel. So, I mean, this is all stainless steel underneath it, but it's just nitron coated. But the only reason I would ever sell this one is just to get one with, that is uh, just pure, uh, pure stainless, I guess, or you know, natural stainless look, I guess you could say. But guys, I appreciate you watching the unboxing review. Shooting review will be out here in a few minutes, so stay tuned for that one. And uh, just uh, stay tuned, like and subscribe, and uh, appreciate y'all watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Ha, 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 ha.